What's going on guys and welcome to Five Nights Revived Beginnings. Now I saw this game on Game Jolt and I was like, holy crap, the Amatoxins thing look absolutely insane. Um, I mostly only saw this one actually and just look at him like his head is shaky back and forth and his eyes are too. He's got like some weird crow sound effects in the background. Like this game, it looks pretty cool so far, not gonna lie. Not only that, but if you click options, Oh my god, it actually has like options, you know, full screen window, you can press back, it seamlessly like connects, like this is like some next level stuff here for fan games. But guys, of course, if you guys want to see more of this game, now this is just, just the demo, I'm not sure how much it's going to go up to, but it's probably going to be like night one or night two. Um, but if you guys want to see more of this game, like when it fully releases, be sure to drop a like on the video down below. If this video reaches 2,000 likes, we will definitely be doing another video on this game. But let's go ahead and start up a new game and see what it's all about. Okay, so closed, local horror attraction known as Widows. Web house. I can barely read. You guys see that like on the bottom of the screen? <laughs> I couldn't really read it though. All right, so let's get into this. Ooh, who's that? That looks like a version of Fredbear, but like a rat version of Fredbear. What the heck? Hello. 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 Yes. Hello. Yes. Hello. Hello. Game receiver. Ah, hello, and welcome to your first night at the most popular restaurant around, Flix and Twitch's Diner. Flakes and Twitch. Oh! I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, sorry about that, Bucko. No hard feelings. Anyways, our phenomenal robots are the main attraction here, as the only diner in the first diner use robotic entertainers. Our robots can also be used as cut or employees at certain times. Speaking of animatronics, we do have an old one, Stephen Barrel, which we received after we bought the industry back in '67. He still has some, uh, issues, so, yeah, we keep him in the office instead of out there with the kids. Wait, office? Yeah, anyway, oh, it's that one, I forgot. About our fantastic company. Now on to what we do. The last night guard noticed that Steven happens to activate during the night, so, uh, if he does happen to activate, look at your camera to distract yourself. Don't, don't need to look over there, nothing too interesting, just don't look at it too long. Just, uh, just look at it for a few seconds. Yeah, then look back and if Steven is gone, click the shock switch on the left. No biggie. Yeah, there's a four-second cooldown time on that, so uh, use it wisely. What? I get bored. Wiring's kind of buggy here. You'll have a two to three second gap between you hitting the switch and Steven surprising you. Again, an issue with this programming. Nothing to worry about. Just keep him out of the office. Please. So that's oh, oh, why is he looking tonight. at me? Oh, shock it. I don't know. I don't know who that is. He's looking at me. I don't know if that's is that Steven? Why is he looking at me? Okay, um, I didn't really get to understand the first wait, he's gone. He's gone. Shock it. Oh, it it sent him back. Oh, okay, so that must be Steven. Okay, um, not gonna lie, I wasn't really paying attention all that much, but hey, you know, that's part of the fun of the game. So if they go missing, what I gotta do is just shock them, I'm guessing. So we have like this weird fright bear looking thing. It kind of seems like he recreated Fights of Freddy's, but like with new characters. Like he kept the same general, like general stuff about the game. Like this is obviously the red one's Foxy, blue one's Bonnie, yellow one's Chica, and then the one on the left side must be Fredbear, but it's like a different version of him. Okay, so wait, we gotta wait for him to leave the area. Oh, what? Wait, what? I, I died. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, wait, I remember. You said don't look at him for too long. Dang it. I completely forgot. Okay, so we died and I guess became an animatronic. That sucks. Okay, so what you got to do is when he appears... Okay, so when he looks at me, I got to put up my camera. And I got to put it back down. And then when he disappears, I got to shock him. Okay, I got it, guys. It's just going to end. It's just like a never-ending game over screen. What? Hello? Okay. <laughs> Well guys, give me one second. I guess I'll restart the whole game. Alright guys, so I figured it out. This is our boy Steven Barrel. I think that's what he said. Basically, what you gotta do is, which by the way, this night's going by really fast. Like if you take a look, look, it's already 3 a.m. The night's going by ridiculously, ridiculously fast. But basically, if he looks at me, what I gotta do is put up my camera for a few seconds, put it down instantly, and then go ahead and press the shock button. And it shocks him right back into his little place where he belongs. Now, one thing I noticed, though, if you click on the right side of the screen over here... Um, wait, hold on. I need to get rid of Steven. Um, wait. Okay, he's he's not leaving. Okay, he, he is staying here. Why? Uh, I'm not too sure how this works. Okay, he's gone. Shock. All right, I think we got him. Okay, if you click over here, it, it makes the camera sound effect. Are you guys hear that? <laughs> I don't know why it does that, but it does. But anyways, though, this little thing I found, um, I don't, it, I don't really understand though because the phone call didn't explain any of the other animatronics. It only explained Steven. So I don't know if he's like the only one that's gonna attack us on this night or what. But 
kind of strange to only get an explanation for one animatronic. Maybe, like, they knew only on night one it's only this guy, and then on the other nights it'd be all the rest. But I kind of figured he'd be, like, the final animatronic, you know? Like, he'd be, like, the final one to activate. Because he looks like, you know, the final boss. He's supposed to be Fredbear. He's supposed to be, like, really cool. I mean, I don't know if he's supposed to be Fredbear, but he looks like it. <laughs> so, I was kind of expecting a little bit more from this guy, but whatever. He's easy enough for me, and I can I can dig it. All right, what time are we at? Almost at 5 a.m., I think. But um, some of the other things I noticed, like, if you click over here, it also makes the camera sound effects, like, near... It's weird. It's, like, on certain parts of the map. Um, also, if you guys take a look at the close sign right there, if you look closely, you can actually see there's an animatronic behind the lettering. <laughs> so, I found that, and I thought that was pretty creepy. Oh, God. Okay, put this up. Wait a few seconds. We're going to change this camera. Go back down. Shock. All right, got him. There we go, and he's back in his place, just where you belong, man. You better not leave. And we should be winning any second now. I'm really hoping there's more to this game, though, because so far it's pretty simple. But then again, it's night one. Gotta expect that. I'm hoping that it does, this demo does go up to night two, though, because I do want to see these other animatronics activate. Because, like, they're there. We know. We can clearly see them. But, oh, there we go. We won 6 a.m. just like that. Pretty simple, but we did it. All right, so what's going to happen now? Ooh, okay, so there's a night too. Cool. I like this little like loading screen too. It's actually kind of cool. I wish it would like switch to like different areas throughout the pizza or pizzeria, whatever the area. That'd be kind of cool to see too. Cause like, oh, wait, we have a phone call. Let's see what he has to say this time. Hopefully, he gives us some good instructions. Oh, one of them's missing. Oh, it seems you made it through the first night on the job. Oh no, the red Great. one's missing. Great. <laughs> see, it's easy. No problem for an expert like you, I'm sure. So Stephen wasn't. Too much of a pain, right? <laughs> yeah. Hey, the last guard complained quite a bit about him. Also mentioned that more and more the animatronics would activate as the nights progressed. Yeah, one of them's hey, missing already. I don't already. know how accurate that is, but oh, I'll he's teach you how to deal with it just in case. Oh god. According to what the last guard said, they will progress through the building into your office. He, he said it was almost like Whoa. you were aware. Now explanation of this was phenomenon that? is that their wireless power cores are being directed to your office. Where it is the most bright and contains the most power. That's also where the power systems are. Something with electromagnets, I, I didn't really pay a whole lot of attention. Anyway, he said Flick started appearing on the second night, and uh, he likes to show up on the left side of the office, kind of his favorite spot. He said he had to use that shock panel on the left to make him return to his original position. Oh, so you can so, shock him too. I hope you're all good for tonight. I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Okay, so flicks, he said? What, what was that thing that we saw before, though? It was like a red one. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. No, there it is again. I don't know what that thing is. It's some sort of, like, dark animatronic. It's gone again. I think it's Steven, or whatever his name is. He's becoming, like, that thing sometimes. Now, one thing I already don't like about this game is... Okay, so see if I put up the camera here. Well, let me see if it does it. I put up the camera. I put it down. Okay, it didn't do it. I think you can move while the camera's up, and I do not like that because... See, look, I'm over here now. Um, because if that one dude flicks or whatever, if he appears on the left side, I gotta go all the way to the left to get rid of him. So, not a big fan of that, but he's gone again, which means he should be coming back any second. Oh, no, it's him now, too. Dude, wait, what if I use the shock, and then he's there, but then after I use the shock, I have to wait a few seconds. What if flicks appear? Oh, no. No, what? What the heck? What was that jump scare? Ha, uh ha, -huh. did you really think I'd let you live? No, not after that. Oh, well, I didn't. Okay. Haha, <laughs> pathetic. You really must suck to die by me. What? I, the game glitched. I mean, I don't suck the game. So <laughs> no, seriously. I have the easiest mechanic out of all of them. So, no. Also, you got to be quicker. I hate how if you press enter, it skips it too. It should just speed it up. If you're dying on the second night, then you are too slow. I am not too slow. This game is broken. <laughs> don't worry. It's only going to get worse. Smiley face. That's all I have to say. Click S to go back. Why S? <laughs> I thought I told you that already. No, when the heck did you do that? There's nothing else to see. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. I get. Uh, I guess I just press S. Why S of all button? That's so. That's so random. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so he made fun of me. Do the animatronic made fun of me for the game being broken? <laughs> Hey, if anyone sucks, it was that jump scare. It didn't even freaking appear in front of me. It appeared on the top right, and it was just a picture. Oh, man. Oh, now we gotta listen to this again. All right, I'm gonna start after this phone call, because obviously I don't think you guys want to listen to this again. Um, what the? Okay, I don't know what just happened there. Um, interesting thing here, though. Uh, okay, wait, where is he? Okay, we're good. You can just constantly press this. 
I could just be pressing this over and over and over again if I wanted to. That's an interesting glitch. Um, not only that though, but wait, hold on. Where? Okay, flicks. Are, oh, there's somebody on this. Who's that? Oh, he disappeared. Oh, that must be flicks. Okay, I'm gonna press this. I can't even. Okay, now that I know that I can press that indefinitely, I'm gonna keep pressing that. Um, but what I noticed though is this guy needs some sort of timer. Like he, this guy right here. Um, I can't remember his name, but. He needs to like have some sort of sound effect that you, when you know he moves because how what it did it again at the same time It did it at the same time. The game is just broken right there uh, Okay, did you really think is it the same one? Okay? He uh, uh, All right. Well, this is interesting. The, I love how the animatronic the jump scare says if you die to this then you suck or whatever But the thing is you're dying to it because the game is broken. <laughs> so It's like what? How is the game gonna make fun of me when the game is broken? I'm gonna try that one more time. I'm gonna just see maybe I'm just getting unlucky But give me one more second again guys. All right guys. We're back Um, I don't know what to do in this situation because I'm pretty sure the game is just broken But I, I was gonna say I'm just gonna keep the camera up the entire time But the only problem with that is I won't be able to see flicks and I won't be able to see Steven or whatever his face and I won't be able to know when they attack so I kind of have to keep it down But I don't know what else to do in this situation like I can't tell if it's just a game being broken, or if I'm just too slow for it, or what? But I guess we'll find out in a second here. Um, let's see. Oh, there's this guy. Hold on, let's wait. I, he needs some sort of sound effect. Look, he's still there. He's still there. Okay, uh, this is great. Uh, are you okay? Are you just gonna stay there forever? Okay, you're still there too. Is everyone just gonna stay there? What? And then he went back. What? What? And then I died to flip. I'm so confused. <laughs> what just happened there? Okay, so Steven attacked, and then he wouldn't attack, though. Like, he, he looked at me like he was going to attack. I put up my camera. That shadow version of him shows up. That thing doesn't attack, so I put up the camera. And then Steven's back in his original place, and then Flix attacks. Like, what? Oh, I don't even... Okay. Guys, I don't know what to think of this game. If you guys want to see more... Oh, okay. And then I press escape, and of course, it just exits out of the game. Like any other Fight Phrase fan game. I forgot about that. Guys, though, that is the game. Tell me what you guys think of it in the comment section down below. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun, though, when it's fully released. Um, it does seem to have a lot of bugs, but, you know, obviously it's just the demo, so maybe those will get ironed out, um, you know, the more he works on the game. But overall, it is a lot of fun. I like how the animatronics look. I like how everything in the game mostly looks. It's a really cool-looking game. Uh, th this music at the beginning reminds me of, like, Fights of Candy 3, though. Not sure why. Um, but also, I noticed that if you click this... Uh, this door right here, which I thought was the exit, but apparently this guy shows up. He says, so hey, what are you doing here? Are you looking for some secrets or something? No, I am not looking. I was actually looking for the exit <laughs> when I clicked this because I thought that's what it was. Trust me, you ain't going to find anything here. My mouth is shut. All right, thanks, man. It, it's kind of like, it looks like it's metal and shut. Uh, why are, what? Why are you still here? I told you, there's nothing to see here. Oh, you don't know how my mistake? What? You don't know how my mistake for this error? What? Oh, wait, what does he mean? Oh, you don't know how. My mistake for this error I will give in. Oh, okay. He's saying it's his error. Okay, I'm only going to say one thing. So don't expect anything else from me. I love how... I, I hate how it shows this text like this. <laughs> On the third night, Honk figure flicks his nose three times in a row. Okay. Don't ask me why, just do it. It will pay off, e eventually. Uh, okay, interesting. Okay, that's all I can say for now. Anyways, click S to return. All right, so that's all. Okay, so if we get to night three, we honk his nose three times, something happens. Well guys, like I said, if you guys wanna see most game, drop a like on the video down below. Be sure to subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.